My name is Raila, and I have a brother whose name is Rayo. And he was, um, he's really athletic person, so he, he can uh, run easily 15K. And um, this particular day, he, uh, he was running, and he comes home, and he goes to take a bath. And then he gets this um, very high fever. And so, and I think it was the next day when he, his fever was so high, he was taken to the hospital. And so, and, and so, and they uh, did a lot of uh, studies on him and they uh, found that he has bacteria in his body and it's, uh, it's in the blood, blood. And so, and um, they were trying with all kinds of antibiotics to get, uh, to kill this bacteria, but um, nothing worked. And he was there four weeks with uh, this high uh, uh, fever, which was 103. Uh, most of the time, so and, uh, he was really uh, um, wearing out totally. His body was totally wearing out. He lost a lot of weight, and uh, and so and um, then I and then I saw his soul came to visit me, and uh, and was crying. And then I came to Master Sars, and Master Marilyn, right? And Master Marilyn um, did this blessing of um, open heart um, uh, and soul. So so, but he was scheduled to the heart surgery. And um, so the next day he had a heart surgery, and so because this uh, bacteria was in a, is, it was in a valve also, see, and so and um, and so, but during the heart surgery, the, um, the uh, something loosened up there and went to his brain, and so he got the stroke, see, and so and um, and uh, then I I called to Master Marilyn uh, about this thing and. Um, and so, uh, you know, bacteria was already dead because this particular bacteria, it's just, uh, you, couldn't, you couldn't kill it. He was four weeks in there with a high fever in the hospital. They, did, they pulled out one of his teeth because they thought the bacteria was in the tooth. And so, in um, so any case, he, um, he, um, he got this stroke, right? And so, and then I called to Master Marilyn and uh, told her that, you know, what was going on. And um, so she says to me that, um, do divine healing hands for him every six hours. And uh, which I did and leave the divine healing hands in there with him, see, for the six hours and repeat this thing. And not only that, but Master Marilyn asked all the divine channels to uh, send the blessings to my brother. And it was just so amazing because I'm still tearing, right? So, because... It was just like at no time I was able to speak to my brother, see? And he had no, no way of talking or no way of walking or anything. And it was just such a joy when he opened up his, when he was on the phone with me and, and we were t talking with him. He's still in a hospital. He has been six weeks total. And, uh, and so, and um, because now he has a therapy to, uh, to learn to walk. And um, so he's doing pretty good with the walking. And so, and, um, and he's finding his voice, see? Thank you, I'm so, I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful that I have a friend like Master Marilyn and a friend like Master Shah and a friend like Master Peggy and all these, uh, all these divine healers here.